So I saw this tweet earlier today that has just stuck with me so much. It was about going to a teacher at a school during the scholastic book fair time of year and maybe offering the teacher a little bit of money so that they can watch their students and purchase books for those kids who didn't bring any money with them, whether they don't have any or they forgot their money or, you know, whatever. The kids that don't have the money to buy a book at the book fair. And it just sparked one of my very few childhood memories that I actually have. And so I blogged about it. I actually was going to read the blog post into the camera, but I don't have a teleprompter and I don't like it when people are like looking away from the camera and talking. It doesn't feel natural to me. And, uh, you know, maybe I'll get a teleprompter so that I can actually uh, read what I want to say while looking at the camera. But I encourage you to go read my blog post. But here, the gist is, um, when I was in second grade, I was, I was a poor kid. I was, I was very poor. We grew up on welfare and, um, my mom somehow managed to put me in a private school in a neighboring town. We lived in Detroit. I went to a, a Catholic private school in Dearborn. And not only did she somehow manage the tuition, I am guessing a scholarship, uh, but also she drove me to school every single day, which just blows my mind. But anyway, I was the poor kid. Now, thanks to school uniforms, people probably didn't realize just how poor I was. Uh, you know, the rest of the kids probably came from, or most of them came from wealthy families. But anyway, uh, for Scholastic Book Fair, I didn't have money to buy books. And those flyers, the pamphlets they send home are amazingly colorful. And I was a book kid anyway. I used to walk to the library and check out books all the time. Uh, and so that was a particularly bummer of a day for me when everybody would get books and I wouldn't. Anyway, Miss Sanzo, my second grade teacher at the time, somehow knew that I was a fan of the Smurfs at second grade, right? Uh, I mean, I still like the Smurfs, who are we kidding? But uh, anyway, she bought this book and kind of gave it to me on the DL. Uh, so none of the other students knew that I didn't purchase it. I didn't bring money. Uh, she just purchased it and gave it to me. And that act of kindness uh, has stuck with me for my entire life, so much so that it's one of the very few memories I have from my childhood, thanks to my car accident. Anyway, uh, if you want to hear me tell the story more eloquently than this, I encourage you, I'll try and put a link somewhere uh, to the actual blog post, or you can um, subscribe to my podcast where it's not really a podcast, it's just me reading my blog posts. But anyway, if you want to hear me say uh, say it a little more eloquently than I am right now, uh, it's a it's a pretty neat start and a great tweet. Uh, so yeah, if you have an opportunity to help kids get books, I encourage you to do so because um, it's an awesome thing to do. Anyway, thanks for listening. This is my video of the day and proof that I should really get a teleprompter. See you next time.